Hey you guys, it's Christina, and today we are gonna be making fully raw red velvet cupcakes with a strawberry vanilla icing swirled on top. Valentine's Day is just around the corner, and these cute little cupcakes are the perfect treat to make for that special someone or even just for your special self. These cupcakes are absolutely divine. Oh my goodness, they are sweet, they're succulent, they're creamy, and they're the most absolute perfect consistency ever. If you love red velvet cake, then you're gonna love my fully raw rendition of these red velvet cupcakes. These cupcakes are free of all processed ingredients, they're vegan, and they are simply sweet and fun and easy to make. Are you ready? I'm excited for you to share these with your loved ones, and I am excited to share these with you. Let's get started. To make this recipe, you will need a food processor, a high-speed blender like a Vitamix, a piping bag, and some cute little cupcake cups. Lovely. We will be making these red velvet cupcakes in two parts. First, we will make the red velvet cupcake filling, then we will swirl on our strawberry vanilla icing on top. This recipe is enough to make approximately 20 mini cupcakes or a large plate of these gorgeous beauties. For the red velvet base, you will need to add into your food processor four cups of juiced beet pulp, two cups of dried mulberries, two tablespoons of carob powder, one teaspoon of cinnamon, one and a half cups of pitted dates, and approximately one large heaping spoon of beet powder if you are unsatisfied with your beet pulp. Pulse all of these ingredients until they have a cake filling like consistency in your processor. Grab little bits here and there and start forming them into your cute little cupcake cups. Voila, you have finished part one of making your red velvet cupcakes. For part two of this recipe, we are gonna be making our strawberry vanilla icing to swirl on top of our red velvet cupcake base. To make this icing, go ahead and add into your Vitamix blender approximately one and a half cups of fresh young coconut water, two cups of raw cashews, three sprigs of vanilla, and just a few really red strawberries to turn it pink. If you wanna add a few dates into this icing to make it a little sweeter, you can do that too. Go ahead and blend up this icing until it gets totally frothy. And then when you're ready, take a spatula, scoop it out, put it into your piping bag, and start swirling these on top of your red velvet cupcake bases. Look how beautiful these look, and this is so much fun to do with anybody who loves any type of kitchen, art, craft, or homemaking activity. After you finish swirling on your icing, you can go ahead and you can top these off with little slices of strawberries, raspberries, or even coconut flakes. If you have beet powder, you can use that as your sprinkles as well. Look at these. Don't these look like absolute perfection? Yum! These little cupcakes are absolute love. All right, you guys. Don't these look absolutely amazing? I think that they look pretty red velvety and delicious. Okay, so I have a mini cupcake here. Are you ready for the final taste? Let's give it a try. First, we must unwrap it from our cute little paper. Oh my God, how cute are these? <laughs> All right, are you ready to turn my mouth red? Mmm. Okay. Oh my God, I don't even know what this, this tastes like the most immaculate candy ever that we ate when we were little. Oh my God, this tastes amazing. Are you looking at this? Look at that. All right, you guys, if these red velvet cupcakes look good to you, I think you should give this video a thumbs up and comment below and let me know how good these look because I think these look pretty good. If you need more tips, tricks, or recipes on how to go fully raw, please subscribe here to Fully Raw Christina as we have fun in the kitchen making delicious desserts together. If you want to follow me daily, see what I'm doing, see what I'm eating, you can also find me on Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram, and Twitter, all at Fully Raw Christina. 
All right, you guys, I'm gonna go and enjoy some more of these yummy cupcakes here, and I hope that you get to go and do the same. I hope that you get to share these with all of your loved ones on Valentine's Day, and I am so excited and honored that I get to share these with you. Sending you all my hugs and my love. Bye. God, I just dropped it. Oh, my slow in my hair. It's okay, I got it. We're okay here. Red velvet. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Is, is there something in my teeth right now? I'm... No? Not even my teeth? You know you're fully raw when you just stop making the cupcakes, period, and you just start eating it out of the bowl as if it's a main course because I do that all the time. Mm. Let's just put it that way. <laughs>